Marking your floors is critical to ensuring the safety of your workers, but a haphazard system can add confusion instead of clarity. Look at all these colors. Thankfully, there's a color coding strategy that's easy to learn and complies with OSHA guidelines. Let's take a look at the most common floor marking applications by color. Yellow helps put workers and visitors in the right place. Use it to mark aisleways, traffic lanes, and work cells to ensure that your employees are on the right path. White floor markings work wonders for organization and efficiency. It helps workers know where equipment goes and decreases the chances of lost or missing items. There are several colors used to organize your manufacturing processes. Blue, green, and black can be applied to denote materials and manufacturing components, including raw materials, as well as works in progress and finished goods. Orange is your go-to for material or product inspection areas or energized equipment, while red identifies defect and scrap areas as well as red tag locations. Use photoluminescent tape to line steps and perimeters to help workers navigate a lights-out emergency. Finally, striped and patterned floor markings draw greater attention to operational and safety critical areas. Red and white striped should be used to identify firefighting equipment, electrical boxes, and first aid stations. Black and white striped can help keep areas clear for operational purposes. And black and yellow striped can warn employees of physical or health hazards. You're on the right path to a thoughtfully designed floor marking system that strengthens worker safety, OSHA compliance, and lean operations. Keep going with a free floor marking guide and expert product recommendations at bradyid.com slash floor marking.